Dear colleagues and park managers, allow me to thank you for the work you are doing, not only to conserve parks, but also to promote them as a place where European citizens can enjoy themselves. Unfortunately, due to other commitments, I could not join you physically here. Yet I wanted to take this opportunity to show my support for the work you are doing. There can be no conservation without the involvement of all stakeholders, including local people, NGOs, governmental agencies. However, tourists can also play a vital role to support conservation. There is an ever-growing trend of tourists who want to visit pristine areas along with volunteer tourism and entities managing parks need to do their best to take such opportunities. Few months ago, along with Europark and the Tourism Intergroup at the European Parliament, we discussed how parks, Natura 2000 sites and marine protected areas can serve as a hub for tourism, provided this is conducted in a responsible manner. Coming from an island which can boast of its parks both on land and on sea, I truly believe that this is possible even if more needs to be done from all stakeholders. I believe that the European Charter for Sustainable Tourism, spearheaded by Europark, truly has a holistic approach towards conservation and making such sites more accessible, also for responsible tourism. I am disappointed to note that so far no park in Malta has been accredited to fulfil the Charter and take this opportunity to urge the government and the civil society to further support such initiatives. I conclude by once again congratulating those parks that have been awarded the deserved certificates and look forward to visit one of them too in the future. Thank you.